greatness of this poem, Night in Tiger Skin, or in, in some translations, Night in Panther Skin, is in its innovative character. For its own time, it was a kind of revolution, because the poet, Shota Rustaveli, was himself exposed to different cultures. He knew Bible very well, he knew church fathers, he quotes them, but at the same time, he knew very well also Greek philosophy, Plato, Aristotle. He knew Greek, uh, Persian poetry, uh, Sufi mystical traditions. So somehow he tried to combine all those things in his great vision, new vision of the world. So when you read Shotaru Stavali, it's like you're reading the entire library, an entire library of great uh, visions and cultures of the world. And he tried to create certain value system, a hierarchy of values, in which uh, the search for truth has a first place, so to say. It might have been a global text for destined to the entire world. He renovated Georgian metric system of verse. It's like 1,600 stanzas, beautifully written, with uh, such a nice Georgian puns, which are untranslatable. Esseraes mautandils lachsa buneba zearsa, ratrupara mechnearsa, it's then continues. So, lachsa buneba zearsa, it's like the, the one who is uh, sharing one's oh, another's uh, distress, something. Zearsa, ziarsa, it's like sharer. But zearsa is also uh, is a pun of the word showing that his nature is like a supreme, zearsi. Rauarea, Mamatsa, Omshigam, Iris Mechelsa, so Job Sahelisa Mohocha, Olisa Mosapochelsa. It's better to gain good name than whatever riches of the world. So good name is gained by exertion of real virtues. So it's better to be virtuous than to be rich, all those things, and it's better to die in, with a honorable death than to live a miserable life and a, a life without honor. All those uh, things are said so powerfully in Georgian that all, um, I, I think virtually all Georgians know it by heart. Jobs ukolo ba katsi sa mumdura wisa kola sa. Odes katsa daichiros mashinunda zmada twisi. When Avtandil says that uh, it's better not to have a person than to have a complainer, it means that he he means that if person uh, is not upright to his own conscience, and if the, his own conscience reprimands him, it's better not to have such person with you. It's better to let this person go and follow the urge of his conscience, because conscience make us truly human. Importance of Romantic love. So romantic love, of course, uh, is not downgraded by Rustavali. Yes, self-sacrificial love towards friend, towards distressed person is uh, most important for him. But at the same time, romantic love is very important. This platonic influence is visible in Rustavali when he says that Eros, Eros is a divine power. For him, the romantic love uh, starts here by a certain divine revelation of your beloved's uh, physical and spiritual features, and it continues to the eternity. So that's also Rustavo's great message that romantic love matters. Last uh, translation of uh, Rustavelli's uh, Night in Panther Skin or Night in, or in Tiger Skin was made by Lynn Coffin, an American poetess. Very nice translation. And uh, she asked me before publishing it to see some kind of, not edit it, of course, it was difficult to edit it and uh, it's, uh, I, the time was not, not much, but uh, so I, just to look through. And I looked through and I, I found out that there was no, no cucumber in this text, a rotten cucumber. Because Rustavelli says in one place, his main hero, one of the main characters, Autandil says that, uh, I don't regard my life worthy of a rotten cucumber unless I sacrifice it for my friend. But there was no rotten cucumber in her text. So I said, where is the rotten cucumber? And she was surprised, what kind of rotten cucumber? And then I translated it for her and I kind of I gave it this kind of uh, verbatim translation and then she, she inserted this rotten cucumber passage in this poem. Nothing is worthy unless you develop in yourself 
such an intensity of love towards friend, towards your neighbor, that you are ready to sacrifice even your own life. So that's the main say of the poem. That's why this passage was important for me. It's 12th, 13th century, it's a hierarchical um, I'll say a setting of society and when Rustaval is an aristocrat poet and he writes for aristocrats. But eventually this poem became part of all Georgians, of all uh, social strata. It became part of folk songs in Georgia. So somehow, gradually, the poem of Rustaval became a national narrative of Georgians, a national epic of all. And so this uh, value system some penetrated the all layers of society in Georgia.